What's good, YouTube? It's your man Rage King back with another one. Yes, another upload to the channel. And before we get started, I ask if y'all please go down there and hit that like button, hit that sub button, hit that share button, and hit that bell for notifications if you're new. Welcome to Realm of Rage TV. This is how we do Rage and Rebels. Crown up. And if you're new to the crew, welcome to the Rage and Rebel Revolution. Now let's vibe in, y'all. More news coming out about Travis Scott. Now let's speak on it. Now, as y'all see on your screen, we got. An article here from IGN. We're going to read. We're going to react to it because that's just how we do. All right. Now, quick disclosure. I don't play Fortnite. Um, I don't really like Fortnite. I have nothing against people that play Fortnite. This is more of just an update of me being a fan of hip hop itself and me uh, and me also uh, just giving an update on the Travis Scott situation. y'all. So let's get into it. Epic acknowledged this disabled the item shops daily section, but not given a specific reason. Epic has removed the Travis Scott Out West Dance emote from Fortnite following the rap star's deadly Oscar World concert in Houston, Texas, which killed eight people. And my condolences again sent out to the eight people that were killed in, during that uh, during that festival and to the multiple hundreds of others that got injured during that festival, man. To anybody that went out there and had anything unfortunate happen to them in any kind of way, my condolences. Epic went so far as to temporarily disable the Fortnite item shop's daily section which rotates skins and other cosmetics and emotes on a regular basis. It's believed that Scott's emote was meant to be included in the latest update. The official Fortnite status Twitter account later confirmed the daily section's removal, but did not mention Scott or his emote by name. Here's a, here's a tweet from Fortnite status. It's known that the daily section of the item shop has been disabled. This is intentional, and the daily section will return with the next item shop refresh. A spokesperson for Epic Games declined to comment when emailed by IGN. Scott's Astroworld is a music festival that took place on November 5th in Houston's NRG Park. On Friday, the first day of the event, a crowd surged toward the front of the stage where Scott was performing. At least eight people have been killed with many more injured according to CNN. Victims ranged in age from 14 to 27, with one victim's age currently unknown. At least 25 people were transported to the hospital. The total number of attendees reportedly neared 50,000. Scott quickly became the subject of intense criticism as the event and aftermath unfolded. The event continued for approximately 30 minutes after a mass casualty declaration was made, according to Yahoo News. It's currently unclear how aware Scott was that was of what was happening in the crowd watching his performance. Footage from the event Collected, the, collected by the Washington Post was shared on social media. One video showed a woman climbing a camera operator's platform to beg for help, and another video shows concert goers toward the back of the crowd chanting, Stop the show. Scott briefly stopped his performance at 9.42 p.m. when he noticed a person in the crowd had passed out. Scott can be heard directing attention to the passed out person and asking the crowd to move away from them. Video from the event shows what appears to be security guards in reflective jackets arriving at the spot. The second day of the show scheduled for November 6 was later canceled and Scott released a statement saying he was obviously devastated by the events of the day before. Scott was previously the star of Fortnite's first major concert event in April 20 of in April 2020 where the rap star was digitally recreated into the towering avatar who danced around the Fortnite Battle Royale map and transported players into space. The event signaled the start of Epic's push towards greater marketing collaborations and public events, and some, and some might say also showed the promise of Epic's plans for its own metaverse. The in-game event was watched by 12.3 million people, according to Epic. Epic released two skins based on Scott's Astro Jack, Astro Jack persona. I think they meant Cactus Jack plus additional cosmetics, including the Out West emote. Fortnite has since had a similar event for pop star Ariar Grande. It's currently unclear if Epic plans to remove any current, uh, any additional content related to Scott or Astro or the Astro World brand. That's the end of the, that's the end of the uh, article. Uh, I'm going to say this. The reason why I did, I read this article to y'all, the reason why I'm even doing this video, y'all, is um, this could very well be the first step into the downfall of one Travis Scott. Now look, I'm never I'm I'm never one to advocate the downfall of any black man, all right? I, I'm never especially me being a black man myself. I, I don't like to see I, I'm not, I would I would never advocate the downfall of my own people. However, 
like I said in the video I did yesterday, if what is said to be true, if Travis Scott did see those people passed out and continued the show, didn't bother stopping the show, if all the horrific things that are said about that that was said about Travis Scott and this possibly being a ritual and everything like that, being a, a, a satanic sacrifice, if this is what is if this was to be true, if this is true, then I'm sorry. This is just what's necessary to be done. You deserve to lose everything you got. All right. And that's the, and 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 I'm not again. I'm not advocating for that. But if that's if that's if what is said about Travis got to be true, if this was a big setup, this one big sacrifice is this, you know, a portal to hell, as some people would describe it as. If this is what this is, then I think this is a step in the right direction. I, I really do think it is. Again, I, I've been a fan of Travis Scott since he came out. I, I've, I'm, I'm a big fan of his music. You understand what I'm saying? But what I'm not going to be a fan of is, is, is being a part of satanic agenda, as you see right there on his shirt, being part of a satanic agenda and, and, and sacrificing of human life. That's what I'm not going to be a, a fan of. I will never be a fan of that. I haven't sold my soul to get to 1,200 plus subscribers. I got. I thank each and every last one of y'all for them, and I can hope that it continues to grow. And I damn sure not finna sell my soul to get a million plus, even though I know damn well we finna get there. We going to get there or I'm going to die trying. Know that, hold that, respect that, all right? But that's just my opinion, man. Y'all let me know down in the comment section what y'all think about Fortnite pulling Travis Scott uh, Travis Scott emotes out of the game. Do y'all think it's the right move? Do y'all like it? Do y'all dislike it? Y'all let me know. As long as y'all remain respectful and logical, we can have a conversation. But that's the end of my video. Hope y'all enjoyed. It's been a pleasure making it for you, and I'll see y'all next time.